Hi, this is a video to walk you through the first time you set up 3G Watchdog Pro. First you'll see a disclaimer about the accuracy and not to install on your SD card. And then you'll see the welcome screen. Click on next. You'll see an option if you've been using 3G Watchdog Free to import your usage and settings. It won't import your widget settings. We're going to um, proceed as if this is the first time we've ever used 3G Watchdog. On the settings page, the first thing you see is your plan, and you'll set your quota. If your quota is something like 500, it won't be gigabytes until you'll want to go in and set your unit, probably megabytes in that case. And you'll also set it per the time range, your day, week, or month period, quota period. The last date you started on, if you start 3G Watchdog and you're in the middle of your plan, that will be taken care of later on. Next we have billing rules, and the billing rules are the rules that are often applied by plan providers. If yours do that, you can add them here, such as don't count uploads or count in blocks and the block size. The next thing is to set your alert. You can set your alert for when you want to be notified, at what point of uh, usage you've used up, your plan quota used, or your plan quota left, or your plan predicted usage. You can set the phone to vibrate. You can also set your notification, notification icon so it's either not visible in the notification bar or always visible, or if mobile data connection, when usage is over warn level or when usage is over limit. The next thing you can do is you can auto disable your mobile data network at a certain point if you install a another program and you would set at what percentage usage you want it to do that. It would turn back on automatically when your plan cycle starts over again if you left it off until then with the auto re-enable connection when usage is back under limit. Update frequency, that is how often you refresh your notification widget. You can do it every 30 seconds, and it doesn't seem to be any drain on the battery. You could do it every hour, but if you do that and your phone turns off, you might lose the data that hadn't been captured from the last time it refreshed. So it's not recommended. And in 3G Watchdog Free, the widget setting was here, but it's not here anymore. You do it from your screen just like you do most other widgets. So that will be in our next video. Thanks for listening.